stay ever. Mm -hmm. But when they come down, they're helping young people to motivate them yeah. to, yes. to, to be something in life and let them know they can be something, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. um, I, I was blessed that, you know, I, I own two service stations in the Bay Area. In the past, I owned a uh, garage, uh, automobile garage, uh, uh, body shop, um, uh, tow truck business. Um, I had a cleaners in this great town. Oh, wow, okay. You know, and, uh, you know, I even had a uh, deliver business, you know, that where that I used to deliver uh, uh, important papers for doctors and lawyers. And, and you all did all that? Yeah. Wow, okay. I, I, so many bin business that I owned that the Lord, and some of them I created. You know, some mm -hmm. of them I just sit mm -hmm. down and, and, and uh, like when I had the uh, moving business, I used to be uh, on uh, four trucks uh, moving people's around the bay, and, and many more business mm -hmm. that, you know, mm -hmm. I own that God blessed me to be able to own, and, and, and I always try to help people in my business, mm -hmm. and, and I had a Christian uh, business, you know, what I'm saying is, uh, I always talked about the Lord in all my <laughs> business, you know. Well, ever since I've known you, that's, you talk about the yeah, Lord, yeah, yes, yeah. Yes. And, and, you know, then uh, Deacon Pittman and I, uh, I started a uh, video uh, s business uh, school on Martin Luther King in Oakland that where that uh, you come down and, and we was uh, playing Bible tapes uh, we were pay playing movies really yeah yeah right on wow. uh, Martin Luther King so the uh, Pittman at the time he used to come down and, and work with me in that business mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. um, so the Lord have blessed me to be able to own many more business that mm -hmm. I just don't want to get off in here. Get off you know, okay. I, I was in the repossessing business with people, cars, and so uh -oh. <laughs> you know, I mean, somebody got to uh -oh. do it. You know, <laughs> you know, it, you uh -oh. know so, so a lot of business that, that the Lord blessed me to be in, you know, to, That's to, good. That's to a uh, you know, um, so I used to sell cars, you know, and uh, okay. Buy cars, sell cars, you name it. Well, you've been, <laughs> yeah. you've been a trade in a lot of different things that. Um, oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, the Lord okay. bless me, you know, because I always tell people that a person that uh, want to do something in life, that's so much you can do. You mm -hmm. know, I used mm -hmm. to be in a hauling business, you know, mm -hmm. uh, I, you name it, I've been in. You've been in yeah. it. Yeah. Listen, young people, you can <laughs> take advantage of all this good advice that you're hearing tonight. Mm -hmm. And that's good. That's a blessing, yeah. you know, because you have really touched a lot of people's lives. You touched mine. Yeah. Look, right. you got me on there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you, you have yeah. touched yeah. my life. Ever since I've known you, mm -hmm. you've been the same way, the same friendly, spiritual friend that well, people you. are. And, and, and you can, your advice, oh, what, what can I say? Good advice, but it's up to the individual. Right, I do know right, that yeah. to accept it or reject it. Yeah. And, and I thank you for that because you have been a big help well, in my thank life. You, thank I you. thank you. Okay, well, let's talk about the church. Oh, I love the church. Um, I know you do. <laughs> you know, um, when I first came out to California, um, I used to be in the church in the South. Mm -hmm. And I never thought that. Um, after I got grown, you know, because when I was young, my mother and them, I don't like to use the word maid, mm -hmm. <laughs> but you had to go but to church. Yeah, you know? back then. <laughs> That's simple that. I oh, mean, yeah. The, you, you know, use yeah. the word maid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah, so yeah. when I got to be grown, you know, everything. Yeah. Um, so, uh, and, and being, you know, went to college for business administration mm -hmm. in Arkansas, m and in, in Arkansas. So I had this business background, mm -hmm. and, and so... Uh, you know, when I first came to California, my mind wasn't on church. My mind was on business. And, and I didn't realize what I was missing, mm -hmm. you know, by not being into the church. Mm -hmm. And the Lord fixed it so that my wife pulled me into the church. Because every Sunday morning, she'd get in our new car. She was looking so pretty. <laughs> and, you know, and she wasn't asking me to come. She wasn't asking no, you to she come. she wasn't asking me about no coming to church. See, that's how you do it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's how you do it. She just dress up and look nice. I'd be watching the football game, you know, getting ready to go back to the service station, make mm -hmm. sure that my men's running everything right. Mm -hmm. and, and one Sunday, you know, um, I don't want to use the word I got to deal with me, but something <laughs> happened. <laughs> I started, I started thinking crazy. You started thinking, I started huh? thinking crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I said, 
wonder what one of them guys she got at that, that church. Cause See, she's that's not how asking. she got you? <laughs> but that's how she got you in there. Yeah, that's what I'm how saying. How long have you and your lovely wife been together? Oh, 43 years. 43 that's years. A 43 years. Yeah. But, but show you how God got a way of getting you back in the church. Um, but you know, uh, I put on my nice suit. She was, you know, took my shower and everything. Got suit on. She said, Doug, were you going to a game or something? <laughs> she said, I'm going with you. Is that a problem? <laughs> That's how you do it. And, uh, <laughs> That's how you do I've it. been in church ever since. Ever since. You know? And, you know, I've been blessed to be with some great people like y'all at 37th Street Baptist Church. Um, I've been pastoring there 30 years now. 30 years? Yeah, 30 years. Yeah, 37th Street. Oh, my goodness. Uh, so, many, so many great it's peoples um, that I have met in, in the Christian life, mm -hmm. you know, being in the church business, mm -hmm. uh, Christian business. Um, you know, um, Mother Elsa Bullock. Yes, um, one of the, the, the sweetest mothers you can oh, I ever. Tell you, I, oh, I really love her. Yeah, she's a great uh, blessing to me. Mm -hmm. My mm -hmm. wife, you know how much I love her. Mm -hmm. um, also, um, great people like Deacon Jerry Pittman, Ernestine. How long Pittman. you been knowing Deacon Pittman? You know, a lot of people think that me and Deacon Pittman know one another in Arkansas mm -hmm. because we both from Pine Bluff. But I know uh, his father. Mm -hmm. I know his his, um, his nephews and everybody. Okay. But Deke just just a few years older than I am, mm -hmm. so he came to California a little before I did. Before you. Yeah, did. and in Arkansas, I didn't know him. But you didn't know no, him. No, you couldn't prove it by me. I know. I know. You know. I met Deke out here through my wife because that's my wife. Um, mm -hmm. Uh, kinfolks, and that's my kinfolks now. You mm -hmm. know, we blood. We yeah. we just want to say we blood. You know, <laughs> okay, <laughs> but, okay. But 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 uh, Deacon, Deacon Pim and I, we've been uh, knowing one another over forty years. Over forty years. Over forty years. Because wow. uh, ever since I've been in California. To have a friendship like that, that that's very special. Oh. Very oh, special. You, you can't agree, you can't beat Deacon uh, Pim and his wife both yes. Ernestine. Yes. We we all came up together. Okay. Uh, and the Lord bless us to be able to not only be kinfolk, but mm -hmm. friends. But friends. You know, a lot of times people's kinfolk, but they're not friends. That's true. You know, there's a whole true. lot of folks say, this is my first cousin. <laughs> but they don't say, this is my friend. No, you they know? don't. No, <laughs> Sometimes they, they don't. say, this is my uncle. <laughs> but they don't say, this is my friend. Uh, yeah. Sometimes yeah. even they say, this is my daddy. This is my they mom. But they don't say nothing friend. about my friend. <laughs> you know? <laughs> okay, then I've heard that. Yeah, You're right. Yeah. How long have you been knowing uh, Deacon Rogers? Them, I, I know when I came to the oh. church, Deacon Rogers and Steve. Yeah, and, yeah. You know, they just—that's like home. Oh, oh. Third well, South Street you. is home well, to me. Well, you, you know, Deacon Roger and Steve. Um, uh, I've been knowing Deacon Roger uh, over thirty years now. Mm -hmm. You know, when I uh, was first came to. Uh, to uh, 37th Street Baptist Church mm -hmm. uh, 34 years ago. Mm -hmm. uh, Deacon Roger was there then. He was there then, huh? And guess what he was doing? What? What are you doing now? He was a Sunday school. He's been a Sunday school teacher that long? That long, that long. Wow. That's what I'm saying. That's been over 34 years ago. I, don't know, I believe he's been there over 40. But <laughs> <laughs> him and him Mother Bullock. You know, Mother Bullock. So Mother Bullock and, and Deacon Rogers, mm -hmm. they've been there oh, from day one. I tell you, Mother Bullock. Mother Bullock been there, she, you know, she left for a minute, then she came back. Okay. And, and, okay. Uh, but she was there before I was there. And then, okay. But when I first came to uh, 37, she was at another church, mm -hmm. and, and her husband passed away. Oh, okay. And she called me to come to the hospital, uh, and I went to see her husband. And then she come back, came back to 37. Wow. So, you know, so yeah. um, okay. she's been there a long time. I just... <laughs> this is up in the Third Seventh Street. I just love it. There, it. There's nothing but love there. Yeah. When you yeah. walk through the front door, you can feel it. You don't have to go looking for it. Yeah. yeah. It's right there. Well, well, you know, one thing I love about our church, I, I always try to motivate our people mm -hmm. to to do this. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we, I always tell my 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 people to that uh, our motto is to to reach out to lost sinner, mm -hmm. you know, people that are already in church. Mm -hmm. uh, we, we don't have a name that 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 we try to get other people members. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. we, we don't do that. Uh, we, we're concerned about the folks out there in the street that don't have Jesus in their life. Mm -hmm. We're concerned about the people that is not 
in church, mm -hmm. you know, uh, but, you know, we on the whosoever will plan mm -hmm. because sometimes people will leave another church and come to your church when the Lord sent them there. But we don't.